Hey guys, it's Avra at home here with a brand new video, and in today's video we're going to be, uh, this is a um, GTA 5 glitch tutorial on how to get quick, m easy money and RP for free, no, no cheats, no mods, so, uh, yeah, let's just get right into this. So first, what you're going to want to do is you're going to go onto your, um, your start menu, Go down to jobs, I just went past it. Uh, play job, Rockstar created, missions, and the one at uh, checkout time. Now, in this mission, what you have to do is you've got to take out the witness for Martin. And you have to be, I think it's a level 35, yeah. Opens at rank 35, so you have to be level 35 to be on to unlock this uh, mission. So what you're gonna wanna need is you're gonna want a lot of ammo. Uh, see that I just got some PW ammo, uh, SMG, you know all that stuff. It's good to have some explosives like <coughs> um, proximity mine, that'll do, and uh, tear gas and grenades and sticky bombs and you know like a rocket launcher or something. Because in case you get helicopters, because uh, you're gonna need, you have to get to uh, five stars. Uh, but there's no need to worry because you still you will you're gonna die. We, you might. Uh, I did in this video, but that doesn't matter because even if you do die, you still have that one life left. So I uh, yeah, make the count. So um, then you're gonna load up into your game and you're gonna just run. You can pick any car you want. It doesn't have to be a certain one to do this glitch. I'm just gonna pick my JB700. I'm not very good with it. Uh, but yeah, I'm just gonna skip it straight ahead to the glitch spot. Uh, so one, so before wait before I take you to the glitch spot, I'm just gonna say, the, so you take out the witness and then then you drive to the glitch spot. So now we're here. This is the glitch spot, and uh, what you want to do is you're gonna park up there, and I'm just gonna show you on the map now, just in case you want. If you want to just uh, pause it and have a look, there you go. That's, uh, that's where it is. So and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna wanna, even if you don't have the cops on you right now, that's it's all right. You don't need the cops. Then you go under that bridge, and there you go. You go up there. Now. This is the newest version of GTA, which I think is a 1.32 or something like that, I don't know. Anyway, so you have to get into the middle before you're allowed to shoot anything. And uh, you're going to need to start getting the police on you. You've got to start getting cops. Because uh, that's the only way this gotcha will work. Because uh, these, you know, because every time you kill a cop, you get, you get more money and, like, more RP and all that stuff. Because it ups your money and, uh... It's best to keep repeating this glitch, like, you can go on this glitch, you can go on the mission as many times as you need to, and, uh, just keep doing the glitch, and, uh, you get more and more money, and, uh, so, yeah, what you need to do is you get to get to about this bit, and then there you go, you stand in the middle. Now, you can basically do whatever you want under there, you can shoot anything, blow anything up, gas anything, uh, as long as you aim it above the surface, uh, nothing can harm you. I mean, sometimes you get the occasional, you know, a car might run over your red, knock you over, and then the character jumps up. But look, you see, I can, uh, I'm shoot. Seeing as I'm actually like underground, I'm under the floor, but the police cannot shoot me. So I'm like, this is a really good spot. It's best to go in first person, but if you're on Xbox 360, which I still have an Xbox 360, and I occasionally play it, but I'm not a PC now. But yeah, you can still do this on uh, Xbox 360, and it's you can do it in third person. It's best to do it in first because it's just a lot more clear. So uh, you gotta get five stars to get the ultimate effects. You know, if you want a lot of money. At the end of this video, you get about 20k. So if you keep repeating that, you'll get a, quite a lot, which I'm gonna do. Yeah, you know, once this video is uploaded, and and this isn't a fake glitch, just because it came out on April 1st, or well, it should be April 1st when it's released. Um, just because it was released on April 1st doesn't mean I'm trolling or it's fake. I actually forgot it was April 1st, but this is a legitimate glitch, and I'll tag in the description, um, the original finder of this glitch. 
Oh, I've, I've forgotten the name off the top of my head, but look, can you see? Uh, my head is just popping out the floor. Top of my head. I didn't even mean that in a pun way. Anyway, see, the cars just go over my head. Some cars just hit me, some cars just run over you. Look at that right now, I've got four stars. So then you, what you're gonna wanna do then is just keep shooting cops, blowing up helicopters, doing all that stuff. Boom. And boom goes the dynamite. <laughs> And then you just wanna just keep doing all that, blowing stuff up, shooting cops, because the more RP you get, and uh, the more RP you get, the m sorry, the more cops you shoot, the more RP you get, and all that stuff, which means you get more money and all that stuff, and uh, we should be getting a uh, boss stats any anytime soon because I'm not actually like playing the game and saying this. Um, this is already pre-recorded gameplay, so just so I can go into a little bit more depth without worrying about police and uh, you know worrying about gaming so uh, yeah I'm just gonna skip it to when we get five stars and uh, yeah so uh, now we've got five stars and uh, you know we've got, <laughs> we've got a lot and it's like saying lose the cops and just drop the tear gas I think that's tear gas? yeah tear gas and you know I'm just like I'm not getting infected by it because it's on the surface and usually tear gas can, you know, hurt you and all that stuff. And uh, like you see, I just got 200 RP for being the fugitive. Um, so you just keep. I'm gonna win. I'm gonna just keep shooting. Get as much uh, RP and kills as possible. And then I think in a minute I actually get hit by a car. Because sometimes the glitch does seem to, you know, because it's a glitch, sometimes it bugs out. <laughs> and uh, you can, if you get hit by a car, sometimes you can, it can like flip you back onto the road, if you know what I mean. It take you back over. It's like if you were under there and a car was on the top. If you click Y or triangle or I think it's F on PC, I don't, I don't really click the keyboard anymore. Um, you get into a car, you just like climbs up to the top and gets into the car. Or if you jump while you're under there, you can uh, get out. So now we're pretty much just outside Madraza, so there we go. And uh, we're gonna get to Madraza, we're gonna just pop out a car. Uh, yeah, if you notice, I changed car just because I'm a lot faster. And uh, Madraza's gonna hop around this corner. Yo, what up, homie? You got the stuff? Yeah, yeah, got the stuff. Okay, that's good. And then, mission passed. And then just keep doing this, you get 15 JP from that, that's what I got. 20k. That's not bad, and look at that, look at that RP, that is, that's pretty good. And, uh, hope you guys did enjoy this video, uh, please comment, click the like if you enjoyed it, if you somewhat liked it, click the like, if you didn't like it, click the like, subscribe, share this on all your social media and with your friends and family, 
maybe they might even consider subscribing too. And uh, put in the comments if I sh my videos are bad or good, and if so, how can I improve on them? This was, uh, you know, you dude, and uh, signing off. Peace. Thank <laughs> you.